Why, hello, my shafties. Alright, um, sorry for the delay in starting stream. Um, right before stream, like literally three minutes before stream, I started noticing a pain on my leg and I was like, hmm, that's not right. I looked at it and it turns out that, um, on my leg, <laughs> part of the skin had just been rubbed raw. I have no idea how that happened. I have no idea how that could have possibly happened because I haven't been doing much today. It wasn't there yesterday. Um, so I was like, all right, I have to bandage that real quick before that gets worse. So yeah, that's, that's my start to stream today. I had to bandage my leg. Um, anyways, <laughs> I am going to put a few disclaimers out before we start stream. Uh, my GERD has been acting up. If anybody has been keeping tabs on my Twitter, you know this already. But my GERD has been act acting up, and for those that don't know what GERD is, it essentially means that my esophagus does not close um, when it gets down to my stomach, because your stomach, it closes up, uh, it pinches tight, and that prevents acid from coming back up your esophagus, and that's called GERD, um, when it does that. So my GERD has been flaring up really bad. I have no clue why I haven't been eating anything that is particularly... Um, upsetting at least nothing more upsetting than what uh, normally happens so it could be new meds that i'm on it could be stress it could be the weather it could be literally anything so my gert has been acting up so you will hear me burping a lot more than normal today because i have ginger ale um which usually helps to uh soothe some of the symptoms when i don't have a very full stomach i have not eaten much today because of it so um break might also be a little longer than normal today but uh otherwise i should be good um additionally i have been also in the midst of a pots and hegds flare up so that has been a little rough uh it's been very rainy and poor weather and dreary these past couple days and it's definitely taken a toll on my physical health um so I was actually half tempted to cancel stream again today, um, but I decided not to because I just, I miss you guys. I miss hanging out with you all. Uh, but if you hear me adjusting a lot more than normal, if you hear me like commenting on it a little bit more than normal, if you hear more pops and cracks than normal, um, if I have to spontaneously take an emergency break, which I've had to do in the past, because uh, I did have a seizure yesterday as well, which was a pain in the ass, um, I'm fine completely okay this is normal uh <laughs> this is well i mean as normal as a seizure can be but it's normal for me it's my normal um so if i have to take emergency breaks and whatnot uh just know that it's because i'm just having a medical uh issues um nothing worse than what i've already faced in the past it's not like i'm bedridden and can't get out of bed because that's normally where my flare-ups put me but i'm not that far gone yet um, thankfully. So I am resting. I have my medication. I am okay. Uh, just know that things might be a little bumpy, not on the technical side, uh, but on the me side, the, the stream might be scuffed because of me. Uh, so just, uh, be a little wary of that. I might have to, uh, refund points if they're spent on certain things. Um, if I'm not feeling up for it because of just health reasons. So, yeah, uh, with all that being said now, I'm going to look at chat real quick um, and see everybody who's talked. Jaybird Games, welcome to the stream. I hope you're well. I hope you're doing okay. Uh, Flame Knight, good job on uh, getting 21 kills in PUBG. I don't play PUBG, but good job. Uh, Miss Strange, good job on getting first. So proud of you. That's awesome. Two-Tailed Firefox, good job on getting second. Uh, we had a really funny conversation on Twitter. I might bring that up during stream. Um, we all understand. Don't worry. Have fun and rest when you need to. Thank you, Miss Strange. Yeah, I'm going to. Um, but I, I felt well enough to stream today, so I'm gonna do that. We've got, uh, Assassin's Creed today, and... Um, first thing I'm gonna do is get this, cause I actually, <laughs> before I started stream, while I was waiting for stream to start, I just had Bayek, uh, auto ride over to here so I could claim this real quick. <laughs> I was like, fuck it, I'm gonna get this teleport waypoint. It's nothing interesting is happening here. It was, I was like maybe a mile away, so, and nothing too special. Um, I'm adding my examples to my comm sheet and then I will send it into the ether. Ooh, let me know when you send it so I can uh, promote it. Um, Cause I, I would like to. 
Uh, but yes, your comm sheet. I'm so happy that you're setting that up. Uh, we were talking earlier about that, and I was really worried you weren't going to, and I was like, no. No, you have talent. <laughs> Share your talent. <laughs> but it's a use. Don't leave it. I was really worried about it. Um, and I'm glad you're, you're, you're pursuing it. You're being brave about it. Um, otherwise, how is everybody today? You now know how I'm doing, so how are all of you guys doing? You guys feeling okay? You guys vibing? Did you miss me? Because I've been gone for a minute. I hope you missed me. I hope you missed my streams. Um, I, I remember what I was checking. I was checking my level. I'm level 18. Um, okay. So we can come into these gnomes then. If we're level 18. We could also fare in Giza. We could go to Giza. But do I want to go to Giza? Not yet. I'm going to wait until I'm 20. We could also explore Immet Gnome. Do we... Excuse me. See, this is what I'm talking about. <laughs> that was aggressive too. That did not feel good. That felt really bad. That hurt. <laughs> really, really bad. Shit. <laughs> Today's going to be fun. Um, that was not a, a comfy, a comfy burp. That was a very painful burp. Um, burps aside, what am I going for here? Okay, let's, um, let's go to this quest. I think abuse of power, because the Thalakatai is coming around here, and I don't feel like fighting Ptolemy's fist right now. He's a little too high level for me. So I'm gonna come around up here, I think, and then circle about. I think that's what I'll do. Um, and try and uh, avoid him where I can. Uh, am I going the right way? I am, good. Uh, Cause I don't, I don't wanna run into him. There's... Why is there just a random hippo kind of walking around there? That's not... And there's a bull following him. <laughs> the bull's like, nah, this is my parent, don't you know? Which is so funny to me. Um... For sure we did! Oh, you missed me! Oh, that's so sweet! Yay! I... You know what? I didn't expect anyone to be like, yeah, we missed you. <laughs> <laughs> I was half half anticipating you all to be like nah, nah, or to not say anything. So hearing hearing uh any of you be like ah oh, yeah we missed you that that makes you feel nice makes me it makes me feel loved I appreciate it. Okay, where is Ptolemy's fist? Oh, he's down that way. Okay, you're moving so slow, my guy. What are you? What are you guys carrying? Nothing. You're just kind of riding. Getting in my way. Ah! Uh, let's come up this way. What's that horse doing there? Just a random ass horse. Uh, I am not... Oh shit. I... Okay. Oh god. Yeah, I love the the graphical errors in this game sometimes. Oh shit. Well, this was not what I meant to do. Run. I'm trying to run. Holy fuck. I didn't mean to do that. My horse just decided it wanted to do it for me. God damn. <laughs> My horse decided it wanted to murder me today. Apparently. How did I get this far away from the road? Huh? Alright, let's... Let's 
circle back around. Holy shit. Uh... I'll... I'm not helping them. Okay, so now I'm back here. Uh, okay, now I'm on the main road. Um... I'm having a good time going to collab later and trying to get this bad boy finished before that so I can get a little drinky. Ooh, collab. I hope you have fun. Who are you collabing with? I'm very curious what you're doing in the collab. I'm very curious about that, too. Is it a collab I already know about? Have you told me about this collab? I, I feel like I'm very, like, not knowing of this collab. Like, this is a new event. Wisp VT! Oh no, the KFC dating sim! Oh man, I love that game. <laughs> That's such a good game. I hope you have fun! Oh my gosh! I'll try to be there. Hello. These crops need to be loaded for transport by the day's end. A little more than a moment of my time, don't you think? I'm sorry. We are normally two, but my son cannot keep up. One thing at a time. Let your boy rest. I will help you collect your harvest. He is too young to be walking the fields. I know it, but my field hands ran off when I couldn't pay. The tax collectors demand all my grain, or they will burn my house down. Thank you, sir. Now I'll be able to pay Sefetu's dogs off. This time at least. Tell me about these tax collectors. They ride the roads all round sites, sticking mostly to the outskirts. Their rabid master, Sefetu, has them taxed the people for all they have. Let me see if I can find them and convince them to change their ways. You work on your farm and raise him your boy. Yes, ma'am. Now that he can get some rest, I think my boy will get back his strength. The gods praise you. Excuse me. Um, never played it. It's a funny game. I haven't played it myself personally, like the KFC dating sim, but I have um I have seen other people play it and it's it's really funny. <laughs> it's absolutely hilarious. I I recommend it. <laughs> um also thank you so much for lurking chat Nobis. I kinda knew you were going to start lurking, but I appreciate you doing so. Um and for uh, sharing your work's bandwidth with us. That is very awesome of you. Very, very cool. Very neat of you to do. Um, scythe. We're just gonna, like, come around. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. Huh. Where'd he go? That way. I'm gonna snipe him. You there. Stop. Hey, Oh shit. Hmm. 
Woo! Oh, damn. I... Fuck. Okay. <laughs> you just... Keep going, man. All right, we'll try that again. Oh, hi, Pen. Oh, shit. Pen's got the zoomies. Penelope. Do you have zoomies? Where'd you go? Whoa. Hi. <laughs> yeah? Yeah? Yeah, girl? Oh my god. What are you doing? You're acting so crazy. What's up? It's been so weird. Um, am I near the blacksmith? <gasps> blacksmith. Hey, buddy. And what did they say? That they passed the field of victims buried in the desert. Who did? Why is uh? I am hidden. Yeah, my cat has the zooms. She gets the zooms a lot. Bro. Hell yeah. I have no idea how my arrows keep missing. Because my arrows shouldn't miss right now. You want to come at me? Come on. You're not going to survive. I like the music, though. Show yourself, I dare you. There we go. All right. He's coming at me. Yeah, you watch what'll happen. Come on. Yeah, that, of course that didn't work. Now they're all poisoned. All right, now I'm very much hidden. Oh no, I've poisoned people.
Nice! Nice. Confirm this kill. And done. Can't get me if you're already dead, buddy. And if all of your guys are dead too. Hate to break it to ya. Hey, buddy. Well, that was easy. All right, and I got all my arrows back. Um. Now, on another note, though. Excuse me. There is a treasure. Ooh. Uh, there should be. Yes. Loot. Thank you. Pleasure doing business with you. <laughs> um, I'm shocked that there are treasures around here, though. Uh, there was another one up this way. Uh, it might have been... Where was it? Um... I didn't grab it, did I? No, because... Couldn't have grabbed it, right? Like, I'm not... I feel like I'm going crazy. Because here's where... Hmm. No, it's right there. In this... This shrine. Okay. We'll go... We'll go... That's sacrilege. Um... Alrighty. We'll go right that. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Desecration of religious grounds. Yeah, that's totally cool. <laughs> Oh well. <laughs> well. Wish I gave a hoot. I don't know. I'm making this worse on myself, aren't I? Um. Uh, where did I mark this? Where did it, it? It's gone. It's gone from my map. I I swear I I click to mark that. And it is not showing up. It's like you shouldn't be coming here and i'm like i wanna uh, i but let your feet carry you to i thought that he was gonna say something else i won't say what i thought he was gonna say oh it's so pretty how oh, pretty this place is love it icky let me see if I can, like, info dump about what we're about to see. Maybe I can. Oh. Ho oh, oh. ho. 
Oh no, I... Mm, that's not... All right. Well, you know... Ah, uh, okay. I mean... Fuck Ptolemy, though. It's not just a shrine to Ptolemy, though. <gasps> but fuck Ptolemy? I... There's nothing else I can say on that regard. Uh, <laughs> um... A little awkward for me, isn't it? <laughs> Most people wouldn't understand why that's awkward, but it is a little awkward. Um, okay, well, I did that. Um, let's go down to the docks, because there is something over there, and I kind of want to check it out. Hmm. What the fuck are you talking about? What are you going on about? Isn't that the same model that's used for the one guy? From, um, the Coliseum. Not a Coliseum, the Hippodrome. I swear that's the same NPC that we saw in the Hippodrome quest. Which is a like, yikes. There's so much stuff to do in this game. I just, I swear we're gonna get to the plot eventually. I I fucking promise, we will we will get to the plot eventually. I swear. <laughs> we're just taking forever to get to the plot. <laughs> Who needs plot when you can explore the world for three hours straight? Well, technically, we've been doing it for almost 10 hours straight, because... Will this hide me? Yeah. I want to find... a more hidden... They're not really hidden here. Thunder? Shit. <laughs> I just felt the ground shake and I was like, was that fucking thunder? It was, in fact, thunder. Thunderbolts and lightning, very, very frightening me. <laughs> right in front of that guy who's running over. Oop. <laughs> I'm sorry, buddy. Uh, You know, it sucks, doesn't it? When all your friends get murdered. Ain't that trust dreadful? Isn't that just the worst? Okay, I'm gonna harass we'll this dude. Cool. Yes, come over. Nice. <laughs> Is it worth sacrificing an arrow if he's already poisoned? Because he's going to get poisoned a second time, so I don't think it's worth kind of shooting him. Uh, 
Nice. Yeah, Bayak. But it was right here. Come on over. Hey, what? Nice. Now I could come around and loot everybody. <laughs> uh, that actually, that strat worked really well. I'm kind of surprised. I didn't expect it to work as well as it did. Like a... Oh, well, you kind of walked into that, buddy. I don't know what to tell you. That was your fault. You walked into the poison body. I didn't kill you. You you just killed yourself there. Okay, I have full ammo. How did I get full ammo? Also, excuse me. Oh, I guess I do have full ammo. How about that? And, oh shit, not what I wanted, Bayak, but thank you for your, uh, overachievement. Um, okay, let's go over here, and then we'll make it over to the next, uh, synchronization point, and then the next question mark, and then we'll move down to this synchronization point, and then we'll just keep moving downward and clear out this area. Um, might come up here as well, but I'm trying to, like, level up enough to... Kind of enter Giza and all of those areas that are like 20. Um, that's kind of my goal right now is to get to level 20 because I want to be able to explore the map properly without um, much issue. And I want to be able to uh, clear out the area that I couldn't clear out before because the levels were too high. It was too high to even like show me their levels and a lot of them were like uh, low 20s, I think. So, like, 22, 23, 24. And I think that's why I had a rough time knocking them down. That goat, or donkey, was on the ground. It was deceased and just got right back up. Oh, that's a... Are there a lot of guys here? I don't look like it. Bunch of mediocrity. And there's a treasure over there. Well, first I gotta get this treasure actually. Anybody? Nope, I don't... There is, like, nobody here. Holy shit. There's gotta be, like, one more guy, right? No! There's, like, no one! Huh. Well then, I mean, it is a smaller camp, but at the same time, I expected more. Mm, the gods here are vigilant. There. Stop. 
there. Nice! Oh, that was so good. <laughs> that had such a satisfactory, like, kill. Nice. Alright, light the beacon. Watch what'll happen. Yeah, that's what I fucking thought. <laughs> fucking, I'll light the beacon! And then... The beacon just explodes on him. Uh, nah, I think they're all dead. I think the lion took out the, the rest of them that I missed. Which is just fantastic, honestly. Well, I need the pelt, so... <gasps> that's been handled um granted in like probably the worst way feasibly imaginable but we did it <laughs> it gave me the experience and that's what matters <laughs> all right eeky My love, I think your father outdid himself this time. I told you the man had it out for me. This guard post he had, excuse me, had me stationed at is impossibly dangerous. It's probably not wise to let a fire in these bandit infested lands, but it's either that or I'm getting eaten alive by hyenas. My dear Behenu, please try to make him come to his senses and let me come home. Damn. Yeah, it definitely uh, looks like you caught fire there, buddy. Definitely, uh, seems like uh, a bad decision on, on your end. Oh, you can see the pyramids in the background. That's cool. I think the funniest thing to me is when, um, 
writers and stuff uh, try to say, oh, they got lost somewhere near the pyramids. And the reason that's so funny to me is because, and I mentioned this in a previous stream, but I just remembered it because the pyramids are literally right there in the game. Um, like Giza's right there. <laughs> What's funny to me is that you kind of can't get lost in the desert near the pyramids. Like, you just slightly turn and you'll you'll see, like, a fucking pizza hut, essentially. Like, it's really funny. I should send a picture of it into my server because it's hilarious. But there's, like, a straight-up pizza hut that's just, like, overlooking the fucking pyramids. It is hilarious. And it's like, you can't... <laughs> You can get lost in that desert. Don't get me wrong. You 100% can get lost in the desert that um that the pyramids are in. Um like you can you can get disoriented and lost. It would be a little bit of a, a stretch that close to civilization, but like you can do it. Like you can get lost there. But like not if you're right next to the pyramids. If you're near the pyramids, you're like <laughs> you can see civilization so clearly. And so every time I, I think about it, every time I see the pyramids, I just think about that fact, and it's just so funny to me. I... I lose my mind. I took that guy out first, even though he was less likely to notice me. Uh, because that particular enemy type is really annoying to fight. I don't like fighting him. Sorry to disrupt you. Oh my gosh. So the guy sleeping there just reminded me of this. Uh, have any of you tried Pokemon Sleep yet? <laughs> have any of you done it yet? Because I was using it last night and I had a really good time with it. I normally hate sleeping because I have CPTSD and that makes nightmares a lot more common for me. So I don't normally look to forward to sleep, but I've been trying to find an app that would encourage me to regulate my sleep and Ayo, I leveled up to try and regulate my sleep as well as to track it overall, because tracking your sleep is, is a pretty good thing to do. Um, it's recommended by many doctors to track your sleep and make sure that you're getting the right amount of sleep, because if you track it, you're more likely to notice something wrong. Like, you're more likely to notice if you're going into, like, insomnia, if you're starting to have, like, a specific issue, or if there's, like, warning signs of a, of a greater problem, you'd be able to see that. So it's, it's encouraged to track your sleep. And that's great. And that's fine and dandy. That's awesome. You know, track your sleep. But also, it just encourages me to sleep more. Which is great, because normally I just am like, fuck sleep, who needs sleep? Sleep is for the weak. But also, now, if I sleep, I get a little Riolu friend that comes and sleeps with me. You are only making it more difficult on yourself. So yeah, it makes me happy. If you play Pokemon Sleep, let me know what you think. brother has barricaded himself inside. Who is it that you're speaking to? It's one of them, isn't it? No, you fool. He fears to fetch his men. But hiding his head in a bush solves nothing. I am not an ostrich. Do I hear horses? Is it them? You better run! Please, if it does not work, Sefetu's tax collectors will do something terrible. I'm not sure I can convince him, but I will keep an eye out for these tax collectors. Perhaps I can persuade them to leave you alone. Why are they so far away? Like, look at how far that is. Uh. Alright, so I'm gonna work my way over there. Um... We're on a boat, so I should probably steal one of these. <clears throat> mm, 
turning. I'm turning. Turning even more. Oh god, no! Okay. Oh shit. Oh my gosh, why are these the. Oof. These are the worst things to fucking steer. Holy shit. Okay. Oh, I just realized there's a oil lamp right there. Oh, they're pretty. I need to, to get me a new one. Mine's old. Doesn't work anymore. It's too broken. <laughs> Oh shit. Oh no. <laughs> I gotta raid this whole fucking camp? All right. How did nobody hear that? Yeah, come on over. I promise I won't drown you. Come here. Come here, buddy. Let me a good time. Oh, did you guys see that graphical glitch? Holy shit. Um, incredible. Damn. That was my bad. My B. Nobody. Nobody see that. Ooh, oh. Oh, yeah, the graphics did go crazy. Holy shit, what the hell happened? Um, tis posted now. Okay, I will... I will promote. As soon as possible.
All right, he's bleeding out. Okay, he's down. He was the guy I was most worried about. Assassin! I think there's only one guy left. It just says working. Oh, he's poisoned. Damn! Oh, did I take him down? Sweet. What do you? Home stuff. Oh my god! Damn, holy shit. <laughs> Why the hell? Sh okay, shells are better than, than macaroni. Uh, and like shells are better, better than the macaroni noodles in my opinion. Um, but no, we don't need anything else. Milk, we have enough milk. We have enough flour. Cheese, we do need cheese. We're having mac and cheese for dinner tonight. <laughs> um, homemade mac and cheese. Which goes unreasonably hard. Um, so yeah, I'm kind of excited. Uh, but yay! Uh, okay, the treasure is in there. So let's go grab that. Okay, you have cheese. Th then I don't think we need anything else. Just those things. All right, we are golden now. I didn't expect to have to fight a whole camp, but you know, it just be that way sometimes.
Desert! We're in the desert. Myth cut. Oh no. Why are there people just around this area? There's also a statue of Ptolemy that I totally plan to destroy. I'm hidden. Somehow. Oh, one dude. Nice. Yeah, you come for me? Gone. Call me crazy, but I think something is close. <laughs> At the ready, brother. Oh, it gives me so many of my arrows back because I'm immediately like. I should be. Yeah, I'm gonna let him come across the poison bodies first. Because if he comes across the poison bodies first, then he'll take that damage, and that might kill him, and I might not have to bother. Oh, he'll come right towards me. And I can assassinate him. Come on. Uh. That works. Come on, buddy. He's all the way over there. Holy shit.
Nice. Look at that. Fuck yeah. Oh, and it gave me carbon crystals. And then there's something up there. Oh shit. Um. Oh my gosh, this is really difficult. Nice. Okay, now that I get that out of the way, I can destroy this statue of Ptolemy. Fuck that guy. I, one of the Brazier dudes is over there. Oh, that's so fucking funny. He's guarding that whole place all by himself. That's hilarious. <laughs> Poor little boy. <laughs> all by his little self. <laughs> oh, I love that. All right, so we'll double back now. Um, I'll go here. Do I have... Um... I did the one quest already. So let's get just kind of follow road to this area. Might as well. I mean, we got nothing better to do. Other than plot, but like, look, fuck plot. Chase! Well, that's a damn shame. Chems. Exterminate. Uh, no, uh, I. We're having mac and cheese for dinner. That's what we're getting. Um, you can be sad with your, your lack of chems. <laughs> you could be it's not our fault that we 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 don't have a weak stomach we can handle chems i mean i i can barely handle chems but you could be sad in your cheeseless life Mac and cheese is really good. I'm really excited for it. Yeah. Hippopotamus layer. I steal. I'm murdered. Cool. So we exterminated that hippo. That was pretty great. Um, is cheese your fav favorite gender? <laughs> Mac and cheems. Uh, yeah, mac and cheems. Uh, you know, okay. 
a friend of mine on Twitter, actually. Okay, so here's a fun fact for you. I have a very sensitive stomach, obviously, because I have GERD. Well, a good friend of mine, Sheepy, had a conversation with me about a brand of boxed mac and cheese that they can eat. And I was like, yeah, I've tried a bunch of brands of mac and cheese and I haven't found one that like I both like the flavor of and also doesn't make my stomach absolutely completely upset. Um, or at least upsets it to a certain degree. And Sheepy's like, oh, we don't have the same like condition, but this might help. And I was like, hey, yo. <laughs> so now I have a new mac and cheese brand that I really want to try. <laughs> You're a cheese ally. Yeah. Then why, why are you coming into chat and saying ew to the cheese? Huh? Huh? Oh, shit. Uh, this has a war elephant, I believe. No, it doesn't. This one doesn't have a war elephant. But it's not... Uh, I don't remember it off the top of my head, but I do have it saved on my phone. So I will look at it another time. But I do have it saved. So, you know. I do plan to try it. I will give you guys my honest feelings. Oh, I keep burping and it hurts so bad. Um, I will give you guys my honest feelings. When I, uh when I try it, crying. Oh, you're gonna check for it? Here, let me see what, what brand it is. Cause I kinda wanna try it. It might not be there. We might have to order it online, but let me check. Um, here. Um, Uh, okay, hold on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna find it. I'm gonna find it. Um, replies. It's gonna take a second. I will find it, though. Uh, I'm going through my Twitter. This was a while ago. But Sheepy, Sheepy did send it to me, so now I'm obligated to find it. I think it was, like, last month that Sheepy sent it to me. Do, 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 do. Well, that's a picture of Sekam. That picture's really fucking cute. Uh, that's a picture of my broken ring and a picture of Penelope sitting in the va vase. Oh no, not a picture of a meme that is absolutely cursed. Uh, God, there's so many cursed things on my... Twitter, holy shit. <laughs> Why is everything so cursed on my Twitter? <laughs> well, that's Sekim sitting on our gross couch. I'm a kitty cat. I'm a kitty cat. I'm a kitty cat. I'm a kitty cat. Oh my gosh! I found a picture of Miss Strange on my, uh, on my, uh, Twitter. Strange, you're on my Twitter. Why are you on my Twitter? I don't even remember why I retweeted that, but like, I'm gonna vibe with it. The dose probably smart in the mo- Yeah, not keyboard cereal. Ah! <laughs> why the shit? What's, what's up with my Twitter? It's so fucking cursed. <laughs> um... I know you from somewhere. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> uh, that's Hyper Light Breaker stuff. <laughs> oh. Oh god, not the fish. 
I will find this. I'm devoted. You remember that cereal? It's so bad. Is it Cracker Barrel? I don't think it's Cracker Barrel. I don't think it's Cracker Barrel. I remember it being like pale white. If I saw it, I'd know it. But that's why I'm scrolling through my Twitter. And I'm scrolling through my Twitter. No, I lost my place. Fuck. I got back up. Okay, I'm caught back up. Um, I wish I could look up replies specifically to a person. Okay, I'm on the... Alright, I found the day that my figures, my Miku Alice in Wonderland figure came in. So, it's close. I know it's close. <laughs> I will find this. Hey guys, it's almost Halloween, by the way. I don't know if you guys noticed, but we're really close to Halloween. I'm fucking excited. Can you tell I'm in a flare up? I don't think you can. Because I am just so full of energy. That's a cute cat. Very cute fuzzy cat. Oh no, not Albedo drinking a fucking uh what's it called? Grimace shake, that's what it is. I <laughs> know. Where is it? <laughs> I will find it. You know what? Uncox <laughs> mix your brownie. God damn, why is my Twitter so crazy? Okay, I'm back to the follow-a-thon. We're just, we're just, we're just scrolling through it. Hmm. I swear I will find it. It's like a picture. Ew. Yeah, that's Goose Goose Duck. Where the fuck is it? Cross. Um. I'm gonna find it. I swear, I'm gonna find it. I am devoted. Only 2,000 tweets. That's all I gotta go through. <laughs> What's up? That's a cute snack. Where is it? <laughs> Found the Ceno birthday post I made. I totally forgot about that. Where is it? <laughs> Fuck the Twitter search function. I miss Tumblr. <laughs> No, I'm gonna find it. I'm gonna find it. I'm gonna find it. I, I'm gonna find it. <laughs> you voted. I found it! Annie's. That's the name. Annie's. And it's really cute. It has a bunny on it. <laughs> I've sent it to you. 
I found it. <laughs> Can't believe I spent a whole like five minutes of my stream looking for this fucking mac and cheese <laughs> on my Twitter. God damn. I am devoted. When I set my eyes on something, I'm gonna do it. <laughs> I was so stubborn. Um... <laughs> but I found it. I found it. I'm shocked I didn't lose any viewers during that time where I was just scrolling and making random comments about my Twitter feed. Clip it. You know that brand. I want to try it. How do you fucking know that brand? That brand is like completely obscure to me for the most part. A hippo's mauling a guy. <laughs> He's all the way over there. Dude, it was a fucking hippo. Cool. Nice. Ah, my horse! You always wanted to try it? Well, now you have an excuse. Is he not poisoned? Hey, weapons ready. What is it? Oh! That's cool. I, I doubt it's it's at any like current store nearby, but it would be cool to get it and try it. You hear that? I would not mind that. Eyes open, brother. Because I'm trying to find something that isn't just like homemade. I want to have easy make Mac too. Nobody. Hey, trouble here. What the fuck is my horse doing? Whoever thinks they can mess with us is in for a rude awakening. You're to crush me. Hey, trouble here. Huh? Keep an eye out for <sighs> Nice. Cool. <laughs> they will attack on site here. Yeah, that's why we didn't. We can't. We can't be on site. Um. I mean, yeah. If you want to order it on Amazon, I won't stop you. I'm willing to try it, but you don't gotta. I'm cool. But no, I was like determined to, to find the fucking Mac type that she be recommended to me for um for sensitive stomachs. I was like, I have to find it. I'm like determined. I am determined to find this Mac. I will find this Mac, in fact, and I found it. Um, so I'm very pleased about that. 
it took forever <laughs> but i found it and that's what matters i have no idea what to expect from it though Mac is one of those things that's like really hit or miss when it comes to um, making it from a box or from like a, a cup or whatever. It's just really hit or miss. Um, oh, it's this area. I hate this area. Yeah, I hate this area. This area gives me anxiety. Yeah, because of that. <laughs> Since there's a whole underground area. I don't like it. Interact. Someone came here with a heavily laden cart. And left the same way. Though the second track looks lighter. I suspect the sarcophagus was transported by cart. It is inscribed to the mark of circuit, the scorpion goddess. But where is the body? Mm. Prior to Sarkat. Celebrates chaos. It invites all that is divine and just. The myster mysteries of the gods are held beyond the door, contained within the secrets of the body. We must call together facets of the four gods. Sekhmet, Mistress of the Desert, Serapis, Lord of Transition, Sobek, Lord of the Nile, and Horus, Lord of the Sky. The followers will be initiated into our order in their holy places. We will share their knowledge and drink of the of their wisdom. Why did they put Serapis? Why Serapis? If this is a comedic ritual, they would not have put Serapis. It's all I'm saying. That is all I am saying right there. There is no fucking way. Because Serapis is someone came here with it. Serapis is um essentially a like weird version of Osiris and it's kind of hard to explain because like what used to happen back then in ancient times was that uh, they would mix the gods of Egypt with the gods of um with the gods of Greece and Rome and one of the the examples of that was Serapis okay so I'm gonna have to dive here oh fuck Appears you're prepared for the afterlife by a clumsy butcher with no thumbs. Where's your liver? This happened recently, and the cart may not have traveled far. There may be more to this mystery nearby. Those responsible should not be allowed to do this again. Yeah, we learn in lore today. Um Oh, fuck. Nope, I'm good. Um, if you want to, you can. I would love that, actually. Let me check real quick to make sure that that's a smart decision. Hold on. Um, I think it might be. I think we should be fine. But I want to be sure. Um... Uh... Dum -da -dum, da -da -dum -da -dum. Uh, 
Yeah, that should be fine. You should be good to do that. It's okay. You're good. Yeah. That sounds fine. I think that should be good. Um. Because I do have a Amazon cart object. <laughs> um. Although I don't think it's available right now. Yeah, no. <laughs> okay, look, 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 look. Uh, it's for stuff. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Don't worry about it. But no, I thought the thingy wasn't available. I thought it was out of stock for right now. Uh, we'll try the box first, because the box is usually, like, their, um... Oh, wow. That missed. Is their, uh... Good try and true. Like, that's their, like, usual recipe that they use as a base for everything else. Now you gotta know? Okay, I can tell you. Mac budget? Don't... Don't be stupid with the Mac budget. <laughs> I didn't think I had to tell you that. Don't be fucking stupid with the Mac budget. <laughs> okay, uh, hold on. <laughs> Let me, okay, send me what you're talking about. What the hell are you talking about? You'll come over and make mac- I have a personal chef, don't even worry about it. <laughs> yeah, the thingy we wanted to buy um, that was in the cart is temporarily out of stock, so that's not gonna work. Uh, but because it's temporarily out of stock, sure, just get the 12 boxes of mixed flavor. That's fine. That's fine, because the one thing is temporarily out of stock, and there's no way we can get it right now. Um, and now I'll take your cooking. It's just that, uh, yeah, it'll take a plane for you to get here. I know, I know, it's so upsetting. We can get it as soon as it's available again. It literally just came out and sold out. I'm sorry. <laughs> like, it just came out. I'll put it on my throne to, so that way somebody else can buy it for me. <laughs> I know, it's so upsetting. But I am going to put it on my throne in case somebody does want to gift that to me. Because I know people like to do that, so. I need to put some food items on my throne. That's what I got to do. Because I know people like to buy food for people. It would take a whole plane. It would take a whole plane. So I, I can teleport? Alright, teleport then. I have a couch for you. It's not a comfy one, but I got one. <laughs> as long as you're cool with the couch! <laughs> Cause I'm broke as fuck. <laughs> I'm living paycheck to paycheck. <laughs> Look at how cute those hyenas are. I love them. Ooh, there's a thing over there, but like, that's not what I'm looking for. Now, don't worry, I'm broke too. <laughs> broke buddies, broke buddies. All I'm gonna say is you're doing at least one step better than me because you have some form of health care. <laughs> That's all. Hey. 
So you're already like one step ahead of me. You got the advantage. <laughs> you sent me a pic? On what? Discord? You sent me a pic on Discord? I hoped it was on Discord. Otherwise, I'm going to be getting a text message soon. Like a smoke comb. Oh my god, Queen. <laughs> Queen just messaged me. Um... Wait, what's happening? Hold on. No, text. Okay, but like there's something going on, on Discord. What's happening? I'll handle that after stream. Oh, I see the pic. Okay, yeah, get it. I did. Yeah, go right ahead. That's fine. Um, that seems like a fine investment of our time and resources. And my Twitch app crashed. No. Cool. All right, now I can now I can look at chat. Speaking of which, I want to get a new handle for your cane. Oh, that'd be cool. I want I want to see your new handle. I want it to be a rose. That's valid. Can't blame me for that, because that sounds cool as fuck. I mean, if you're gonna have to carry it everywhere... Respects to your twist. <laughs> if you're gonna have to carry it everywhere, might as well make it look pretty, right? Nice! Nice! Look at these trick shots! Aren't I so cool? You're literally on fire. Like, you are on fire, my guy. I think I've cleaned them out, though. Cool. Alrighty. Oh, 
And I think that's all I gotta do. In that area? Yes. Now there's some quests over here. All right, so navigate around. That's wind. Sandstorm? Bruh. Sandstorm coming. Okay, so there's that there. Which I also need to find. And I also want to write that. So we will keep on moving. Ooh, pretty. Pretty temple. Ah, oh, shit. Welcome. Welcome to Litopolis. Dream of the great Tahaka. A new life awaits you in the glorious city of Latopolis. A chance to begin again. Oh, that's fair. <laughs> Welcome. Welcome to Litopolis. I never forget a face, and I have not seen yours before. I'm looking for to have you found it. Your new home. Oh no. A man's labor. Not an entrepreneur. No, th that's not what you just don't know it yet. We give every new arrival a house. Only dig it out and help with the public works. A fresh start. I'm not here to live in these tough sands. Speak to some of our new inhabitants, like Nehi. He can tell you how liberating it is to leave the past behind. I cannot shed my past like a snake sheds his skin. This entire city was lost to the cool desert in the time of our ancestors. But the great Tahaka rediscovered its secrets. He is uncovering it to shine again under the sun and dedicating the city to Horus with... What the fuck is this guy going on about? Like wings, we will reach the stars. Oh my god, he's crazy. Um... When I play OW2, I kind of turn into streamer mode. You know what I mean? Yes, I do actually. Just it's streamer mode is one of two things. You either zone in super hard or you can't shut up. Like you're doing one of two things. You're either not talking at all or you're talking a little too much. <laughs> but no, I feel what you mean. Um, just kind of like super focused in on that. By the gods, what am I to do? Peace, friend. What happened? Gods have cast me. I lost my farm and my wife to my brother in Yamu, and now I've lost what little I own. My cart got stuck in a ditch far from town. As night came on, I heard terrible roars. Yikes. And I just left them. My poor oxen, everything I owned. Wh what am I to do? Roars. There are no large beasts in this region. I did not stay to find out. They were the last gift I got from my father, Kufu and Kiera, uh, and I left them there with all I own. When I am out that way, I will see what I can find. For now, do what you can on your new house. My thanks. My house is to the right of the entrance to the temple. May you fly with the bright wings of Horus. I think it's interesting how he says Horus's name. <laughs> Has a bit of an accent to it. <laughs> Not a problem with that. Um, I'm shocked they didn't use their like actual comedic names. I'm really surprised that they used everyone's Greeks names except for Osiris, who they didn't call him Osiris half the time. They called him Serapis, which is just weird. Why did they do that? <laughs> it kind of makes me mad. <laughs> Actually, it makes me very mad. It doesn't make me a little mad. It makes me extremely angry. <laughs> I don't like it. Here, let me help you with that. Oh, what? You think me helpless? I'm surprised to see a woman in your condition working so hard. 
The arrival of a child is a blessed event. Oh, I am no delicate lily. Oh, are you in pain? Ah, my little Dean is just making herself known. My workers are so slow, I need to run over and check on them. Allow me, Lebet. Oh, that's cute. All right, we'll do the find and speak to the workers one. All right, over there. God, this game is so big. I forgot how big this game was. Cause there's like two other sections that we haven't even like begun to explore yet. Holy shit. There's so much. Temple of Horus. What the fuck are they doing down there? Baba! Ipui! Can you hear me? What's up, bud? What the tunnel collapsed. Baba and Ipui are trapped inside. How can I help? Are you strong enough to clear the way? See if you can bring them out. Please, Neb. They are my brothers. Stay here. I will do what I can. Alright, Simbona. What? This doesn't look very collapsed. I'm going to have to force our way through. I actually don't need much illumination. Hey there, are you hot? Ah, I twisted my ankle. My brother Baba was working further in. The tunnel collapsed. I don't know Excuse if me. he's alive. I will get you out first, then find him. Careful. I think I heard a hissing sound nearby. Six. All right, I'll carry him out the tunnel first. All right, he's good. I will help him from here. You need to go back and find Baba. Hurry! He might be hurt or worse. Take care of him. I will find your last brother. Thank you, Neb. All right, cool. Um, I do want to point something out while we're talking about snakes and poisonous things. Um, so Sir Cat, right? Uh, goddess of scorpions. But I'm kind of surprised by how they interpreted her in this game. Because she's also a goddess of healing, but at the same time a goddess of poison. Because... Forgive me for killing your green ones. There is no other way through. Oh no, I don't want to kill the snake. Look at how cute it is! Damn. It's, it's scenting! It's doing little tongue flicks! Little baby! Um, but no, it's kind of weird that they made Sir Cat this, like, villainous goddess? Like, that's how they interpreted her? I mean, yeah, she did have followers who were uh, less than stellar but any deity had followers like that like you, you can't you can't interpret them like that though yeah i know i'm so upset <laughs> snacky you think don't eat the snakes don't eat snakes don't don't eat snakes don't eat snakes just like grass you shouldn't eat snakes uh Apotheosis Papyrus. We are victor victorious, the divine lion, the powerful one whose breath formed the desert, whose tongue is as rough as the sand, whose eyes blaze with the heat of the sun. The fiercest of hunters will swallow this profane place. The city where man professed themselves greater than the gods. We chosen fall towards apotheosis. While our enemies fall in disgrace, the city and all within will lay beneath a blanket of sand for a hundred years. In exchange, she will let the rest of the Nile prosper under the god of the sky. Woe to any who seek to unearth it and take the treasure from the goddess. Hmm. The history of the lost keepers of this place. The sword is missing. I wonder if Maher has succeeded at the house of Seth, or whether his cause was lost there. As God's servants, we bear witness to the voyage of Mahes, son of Sekhmet, to confront the invaders who come from, from out of the sun. We have blessed the sword of Ta and placed it in Mahes' hand. 
sending him across the river to rally our spears at the house of Sorket. Mahas must stand against the armies of Ulkus, who is called Artaxerxes, who march from the city of Uz to lay waste and enslave us all. Mm. The Eye of Kemwer. Our wonderful, magnificent city is caught in the battle between man and god, the river and the desert between Horus and Sekhmet. When our ancestors founded it, it was dedicated to the Great Black One, the falcon whose right eye is the sun and whose left one is the moon. That's... that's Horus. But over the past months and years... Oh, it could be also interpreted as Ra, but in most... in most cases it's Horus. But over the past months and years, the lady who mauls... Sekhmet has come closer and closer. A summer feast in her honor no longer sways her. She creeps even ever closer, and the breath of the war lion brings the heat and the sand of the desert into the heart of the city. The oracles say she wishes to claim all Egypt for herself and swallow it whole, unless we make a grand sacrifice. Her wab priests have told the Namark to give up the city, and that will appease her. Hmm... Interesting. Hello. Are you hot? No. I managed to squeeze in there just before it collapsed. I had no idea this was here. We were digging to reach the river. That place was probably part of the old temple. Do you need help getting out of here? I am fine. I am going to meet with my brothers and take a break. <laughs> He's totally what fine. What is this place? Um, I should touch grass? I would if the grass wouldn't hurt me, probably. Um. Because I'm gonna be honest, that's what would probably happen if I touched grass. I'd probably be in pain. Because I touched dirt the other day. Yeah, I touched dirt with too high of pH and it started burning my hand. I was like, the fuck is going on here? What is that? What the fuck is that? Where'd you- What? Where'd you get that? Did, did you just find it? I saw somebody- I what? saw somebody with it and they were like, Oh, you like it? Here. And I was like, what? And then his wife came and he's like, Hey, well, you know, he orders them in like packs of 12. So like- Why? He just gives them away. <laughs> Why does he order them in packs of 12? To keep them in the what the good. fuck? <laughs> I thought you didn't buy them. You could spin it. I hate that. Bruh, it's just a coin holder. That's all it is. I hate it. Alright. Shoo. Shoo. I'm gonna... What? I mean, you can take one. It's just a caramel chocolate. You can take one. Not like it's a big deal. Oh, well, to you, everything's a big deal. I don't care I'm offering you one. Okay. Chief Nito, the well tunnel partially collapsed, but I was able to help the workers. My little bean and I are so fortunate you passed by when we did, Nedjai. May the gods bless you a thousand times for your efforts. Take care of yourself. May the gods bless your little one. Hey yo. I'm gonna find this papyrus and then we'll take a break. Um, Cause it's about ready for break time. So excited. But yeah, I touched dirt with too high of pH and it burned. So that was a good time. Um, In Southeast of Emmet Nome, lies a broken tip past time till morning and X will mark my hiding spot. Hula. All right, so when we are back from break, ooh, that's over there. Um, I gotta go get that. But when we are back from break, I will claim that. Um, which I can come into these areas now, but I will claim that and probably like 
open up this area while I'm at it, since I am now level 20 exactly. Um, so I'll come up here, claim that, come through here, unlock that, and open it up to start exploring that area, claim that, and these things over here. Um, go to these quests. Holy shit, those are quests over there. Uh, so yeah, that's kind of the game plan right now. Uh, but otherwise, we're gonna go take a quick break. I'm gonna take, like, 20 minutes or so. Uh, it might be a little longer, given everything that I mentioned at the beginning of stream. Um, but we will be back in just a little bit. Go get something to eat, go get something to drink, uh, go stretch, go get a breath of fresh air, go use the bathroom. I know one of you is holding it in without realizing it. Um, and we will see you guys back here in just a little bit.
And we are back. Hello, everybody. Hope you guys are feeling all right. Hope you guys are well. Um, we are now back and going to uh, try and get to this waypoint over here. I think that's the smartest thing. How was everybody's break? Everybody feeling okay? I'm burping a lot. I'm sorry. Uh, but no, I hope everybody's break was okay. Hope everybody had a good time. Um, that everybody had a is, is feeling the good vibe. I don't know where I'm going. I'm a little lost. Um. Where am I supposed to go here? There. Okay. Hop up. Alright. Um, can I? Yeah. Hop up. Oh, we're getting there. We're getting there! Hell yeah! Okay, that took way too long to figure out. <laughs> Whoopsie! And sink! Parkour, parkour! Um, we need to watch The Office. You haven't seen The Office, yet, Nubis. Parkour. Parkour. <laughs> parkour. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody would expect us an assassin game to be so much parkour. I yeah, really though. It is a lot of parkour. There is there's oh, oh way too much parkour in my opinion. I mean I don't mind it, but it's it's a lot of parkour. <laughs> a lot more than you like would initially anticipate it to have. But there is quite a bit of it. Where's my horse? There's my horse. Alright, so we're gonna go destroy this. Statue of Ptolemy. I think it might be. I think that might be a sausage of some kind. Aren't you supposed to be drawing, Janubus? I know what you're supposed to be doing. Doing art. You're gonna Google it? I see. All right, let's get to this Ptolemy statue. Moon so fast. You must also keep me company. That's okay. I can just like ramble. It's not a big deal. I've been doing that. I don't mind. You got work to do, so I don't mind rambling. I got a lot to ramble on. You guys can deal with that hippo. That whole like, Bowie homies and I love you and I'm fed, you are fed and I offered you chocolate and you said no, so that's your fault. Oh. Let's see here. Do 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 do. Count now? Yeah. So let's go over there. Oops. 
something chewy? Why would you want something chewy? Serpent of Serapis Ostracon. Serapis, husband of Iset, god of the dead. Did you ever see the serpent of Serapis? A spear light as a feather and sharper than Sobek's tooth. With such a spear, I could be a champion in the amphitheater. Shame about what happened to it. Serpent, husband of Iset, god of the dead, who. Dip this spear in the Nile to make it light and true. Serapis, who watched over our dying king, who sharpened this blade to the edge of night to make it ever sharp. Tool, I name you Serpent of Serapis and dedicated to, dedicate you to the gods. Ah, the Serpent of Serapis. You have heard the tragic tale? Not the whole of it. Oh, it was a true masterpiece. The shaft wrapped with water-hardened leather. The blade hammered out of the metal of heaven. I would love to see it. Impossible. I crafted it for one of Apollodorus's captains when I lived in Saïs. But Seteto's soldiers killed him. That is the reason I left. Seteto? Yes. Seteto the Firebrand, who governs Saïs with flame and fear. One of his bootlickers stole the spear that bears my mark. Outrageous. Can you not get it back? The man is beyond my reach. He sails on one of Sepetu's triremes on Mary Atlas Lake. Ah, I hate Apoli. My travels take me far and wide. If I come across him, I will look for your spear. I would love nothing more than to hear of his fall. If you manage it, the Serpent of Serapis is yours. All right. Hello, friend. Come to trade? I'm gonna see if I can upgrade some of my stuff. I might not be able to. I might have to sell first. Done. And then sell all these. Agree. Is fair. Agree. Is fair. Just just take it all. Done. done um now let's see what our upgrades look like a lot less red um i use the barbed longbow a lot more don't you mess with singer too much in what me in but i am be but i am a irish met so I think I'll level that first, because I used this a lot. I don't... Oh, I do have enough, actually. To upgrade the other one. Is that it? Yeah. There it is. Nice. All right, let's grab this other quest while we're here. See what's going on. Strong must clouds the air. Tana lives nearby. Oh, the gods shame me, Neb. The Tanner is my husband. He carried that stench home whenever he returns from camp. Is he here now? By the smell, you would think so. But it's worse when he's around. <laughs> do not let it trouble you. We all must do what we do not relish. You are right. My husband works hard, but cannot keep up with the demand for his services. The Medjai are said to be legendary hunters. If you would like to earn some good coin, go and see him. I'm sure he could use your help. Hmm. I will consider it. Where would I find him? His hunting camp is north and west of Sal. He will be tanning hides for a few days. If only there was some way for him to deal with the stink. I see. Okay. Um. Let me check what we got on the map now. 
Because we got those quests, which I could do at any point. Um, it'll just guide me right back. Uh, but there's still some stuff in this region that we haven't explored yet. Okay, we haven't done our obligatory in the water area. So it's time to do that. It's time to confront my philosophobia at least once. I mean, I could count the one little underwater cave, but I'm not going to. Because that's not very cool to do. I'm trying to figure out who's in the room next to me. I hear noises, but I don't know who it is. I keep hearing, like, shifting and stuff. I don't know who's messing around in there. I kind of want to figure it out. Not for any other reason other than I'm really curious. Hmm. Oh, God. What the hell? I get to check. Yeah. What are you doing in there? What? Oh, you're getting avocado. Okay. I was like, I didn't know why you were in there. I just heard somebody moving around in there and I didn't know who it was. <laughs> okay. Ba da ba 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 da ba ba da 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 ba da fucking bullshit fucking bullshit fucking bullshit holy shit motherfucker fucking bullshit goddamn bullshit fucking bullshit son of a bitch what the hell why why okay no 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 <laughs> ah, fuck you. That is one hell of a song. Yeah, I, I sing it whenever I think something is bullshit. Killing every single fucking crocodile. Oh. I'm okay. I got about. Thanks, bud. This these hides are just kind of like I'm just gonna like collect what I reaped. Uh, yeah, that's one of the things that scares me about the ocean. Like, anything could kill you at any given point in time. You just gotta invoke it. And it'll it'll come for you. It'll come for you. 
It'll kill. It'll just murder you, and it'll have no hesitation. I mean, most animals won't, because they haven't seen a human and they don't know what to do. But like, especially near the surface, those animals definitely have seen humans. They know what to do. They know that you're an easy meal. They know you can't do shit. They know that you smell good, and they're gonna eat you, and they're not gonna have any fear. Hi, Sekum. Sekum, why are you so long? Hi. Oh, oh. Hey. Hey, 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 hi, are you my comfort Becca? Yeah, oh, yeah, doesn't that feel good? Why are you making that face? Not making that face. Mwah. Yeah, you wanna sniff the mic? The mic seems scary. Yeah, oh. Yeah, look, I'm rubbing your chin. Oh, yeah. Oh, you like that. Mwah. What are those? What happened? See, they fucking rock. No one never had such a hard time cutting him. Hard avocado. Hard avocado. Anyway. The avocado that was in the fridge froze. <laughs> um, anywho. Uh, that is one hell of a song. It really is. Um, <laughs> easy clap, I wish. To your left, I don't have that phobia. That scares me. Yeah, it's terrifying. I don't like it. I don't like it. You know, I don't like it one bit. It makes me uncomfortable. It makes me very uncomfortable. Uh -uh. All right, so I'm gonna come down this way. Because I wanna see what that is. Yeah, it was a frozen avocado. Our fridge is too cold, apparently. It, it sometimes that happens and we haven't adjusted the temperature in forever but our fridge is apparently too cold which is weird because we don't adjust the temperature but sometimes it just gets like that and so it froze the avocado because it got too cold <laughs> for the avocado which is just weird um so chat was just telling me that he was having a rough time cutting open the avocado because it was completely frozen. Like it was hard and like a rock. And so he's just waiting for it to soften up. You cut all three. You're going to eat all three avocados? <laughs> all three to be sure. Are you going to eat all three avocados or like... How you, how you doing this one, buddy? A poor attempt at avocado ice cream. Facts. Yeah. It's unfortunate. <laughs> but it'd be that way sometimes. Yeah, it was in the fridge door. It wasn't even deep in the fridge. It was in the door. <laughs> Which is even worse, I think. Oh, so you just decided on banana while you wait for the avocado to thaw? I just looked back and saw- yeah, you settle for a banana, waiting for the avocado. Who is trying to fight me? Oh, it's a bunch of hyenas. Joke's on you, I need your skin!
down for the count. That's a lot of hyenas. I didn't need to wipe them all out, but like they just kept chasing me. Uh, you goat him. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> sure we fight, but only if I could skin you after. <laughs> and your brother, and your grandma, and your nephew, and your great aunt on your dad's side. <laughs> Well, it wouldn't be a nephew. Cause like those are all f those those are all that would be a niece, because those are all female hyenas. Cause male hyenas are one way smaller and two, they don't leave the 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 dens. They don't go out. So those are all females. Until we go to a hyena den, in which case then it might be some males. The music. There's nothing here. Focus. No messing around. Show yourself. I dare you. Can I get this guy over here? Hey. What was that? Ah uh, yes, there totally isn't a strange horse in this area. Totally no strange horses. I should be cautious around here. Nice. Way. 
I didn't like how he sounded. Kind of sounded like a kid. It made me uncomfortable. Are these the last two guys? He Balden. Won't survive an encounter with me. Yeah, you don't think so? Feel that? We are one. All right, I'm awake. Nice. Oh, that felt so good. Uh, they will attack on sight here. Look at that. He poisons himself, while the other guy just kind of like strolled into my trap. That worked out a little too well. I love that. What what is my horse doing? Let me. I got a hammer. Okay, nothing else left. Alright, let's. Oh, wait, there's some stuff over there. Whoa. Yeah. yeah, dude really said angry face. That's a fact. Alright, carbon crystal. Hell yeah. But are there any... I don't think there are any, um... I don't think there are any bow... Like, not bow, but arrows. Which is unfortunate, because I kind of, uh... Need those right now, but uh, it's fine. We can figure it out. Um... So I got down there. I'll I'll make my way up this coast. To find the uh cuz now I'm going to go get to that tower over there so I can get the check mark. Open up the waypoint, get more of the map unlocked. Dismount. This one's easy. It's got stairs. Look at that. Bike will still try to climb the wall in lieu of a ladder, though. Synchronize! Fast travel unlocked. Also, still looking at those pyramids over there. Okay. Well, now that we got that, we will keep moving north. Grab that, and then maybe grab this. I uh, maybe grab that. Or I'll move in. To, uh... Here. I can go in there. I have enough of the levels too. Uh oh, we'll 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 focus on Sop Main Gnome first. Yeah, really though, his storage has been backed up into the cloud. That really do be it though. That doesn't seem like there's anything else other than like ease, which we now have. Um so I'll finish 
this. Uh, do I have the... Yeah, there we go. Uncompleted locations. Oh, wait. It doesn't show everything. Okay, there we go. Now it'll only show me the stuff that I haven't gotten yet. Which is a huge help. So we'll go get the stuff that we haven't done yet. And hopefully that'll give us enough levels. Who's making that noise? There's a croc over there. Animal attack handled. I love that it gave me the exterminate threat after I killed the last of the enemies in this area. No! Are you hissing, Chanubis? I didn't know you could hiss. I didn't know. Thought you were a dog, not a snake. And yet here you are. Telling me that you are, in fact, a snake. I would have never have known. Should have told me. I would have given you a nice juicy mouse. Guess. Uh, what? Sure, I, I can. Poorly, you know? <laughs> yeah. Are you sure you don't want a nice, juicy mouse? We got some in the freezer. For anyone who doesn't know that I own a snake, that's terrifying. That I just have, like, dead mice in my freezer. I do have dead mice in my freezer. It's for my snake.
Nice. You can't get to me when I'm up here. There we go. Crocodile layer completed. Statue of Sobek, Sobek. Lord of the Nile. It is contained within a symbol that invokes circuit, the scorpion goddess of magic. <laughs> Must have brought the sarcophagus by Feluca. Could you remote place for this? Some of those marks on the body look like the sacred organs were removed. At least the lungs are gone. Hmm. Well, that's not good. Embalming is uh, it's very sacred. So it's kind of really bad if if stuff is missing or stuff isn't in the right places or stuff isn't prepped properly it's a it's a real bad bad thing looks like the pilot got away but left him bombing tools Ugh. Is that a bone no that's a scroll dark and foreboding invocations Prior to Sirket, we call upon Sirket, who holds the breath and delivers the poison. We bring priests of the four gods to their sacred places, and we give them the glorified rights to meet Sirket in her place of power beneath her heavenly, heavenly sign. Their powerful divine organs contain the secrets of divinity. We sacrifice them to appease the goddess of magic and medicine. Ooh. These deaths are a harrowing journey into madness. What could the perpetrators hope to gain by invoking the goddess of magic? Oh, that's not cool. Um, yeah, I knew about that already, by the way. The Google Play streaming games thing. I knew about that. To save space and all that. It's like, kind of why you do it. Uh, but I knew about that already, actually. Thank you, though. It is very neat. You're right. I just knew about it already. <laughs> so it's not news to me. Um, but I appreciate it nonetheless. Okay, so let's come up this way. Yeah, hey, ready? We're like going all over the place. An April Fool's Candy Crush. I already have an April Fool's Day game planned out this year, this upcoming year. Don't worry about it. And you guys are gonna forget by the time the first of April rolls around again. But if you don't know, I tend to like tease a game that I'm gonna play and then just like turn around and play a shit post instead on a on April 1st. It's harmless. I'd still do my stream, but like it's a funny little thing that I do. Um if you were here last this past April Fools, then you know I was gonna start playing um I think I was gonna play Project Diva on April 1st. Like I teased I was gonna play Project Diva and I was like, oh I'm playing Project Diva. And then I ended up turning around and just playing Rumbo First Blood. But I already have a game planned for for this year. Um, so you don't even worry about that. Come here. Oh. 
Oh my gosh, stop running. Scaredy cat. Poor snake. Anyway. My two experience. How lovely. Hyena layer. See, here's where you would find the male hyenas. Oh, she's so pretty. I'm sorry. Yeah. Hyena queen. Where did you come from? Puma? What happened? Where did this fucking panther come from? Oh, what? Is it supposed to be a cheetah? Because cheetahs are not aggressive in the slightest have you guys ever seen like cheetah stuff like they're they're not aggressive they're very docile um that doesn't mean pet the cheetah don't pet a cheetah but just know that cheetahs are infamously docile animals they're not known to be aggressive towards people they're actually very kind um usually to humans they get along very well with them um again that doesn't mean go pet a cheetah please don't go pet a cheetah uh but do note that they are notoriously skittish and they like meowing they don't like roar they meow which is really cute Oh, lovely. This is a huge fucking crocodile layer, holy shit. That's a really pretty crocodile. I love the white crocodiles. Because, like, normally crocodiles have this, like, brownish-green color, but when they appear, like, ashen like that, it's so pretty. Like, that silvery-gray-white color. 
They're so pretty. Also, yes, yeah, she does have emotional support dogs that encourage them to breed in captivity. That's another fun fact for you. They have uh, anti-anxiety dogs. Oh. Oh, man. There we go. I need that leather, so that's why I'm killing so many of them. Uh, cheetahs not only meow and not roar because, well, they do, but it's actually because they lack the threat to roar. This is true. They are very docile creatures, um, but also they don't really want to roar. And they're also um, not usually looking for a fight. They're mostly like ambush predators uh, to a degree. They're ambush and pursue, if you didn't know. They lie in wait and sneak up on their predator and then dash after them. All right. And down. Huh. Cheetahs are very cute though. Although again, I would highly discourage uh, petting cheetahs. Just, just as a general, they're still a big cat. Don't pet cheetahs. They still have claws that are not afraid to tear. Do not pet a cheetah. They're cute, soft, and docile, but like, don't pet them. Also, their fur is described to be soft, so do know that. Know that you can never pet one, but that its fur is very, very soft and, <laughs> and nice to the touch, apparently. Um, so yeah, be sad that you can't pet a cheetah. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure you can, but, like, I don't think it'll turn out very well for you as a person. Okay. So, now that we kind of explored, I want to come up that way. I want to fast travel here and go over to there, because I haven't um, wiped out that camp, and I really want to, and I feel like I'm a high enough level to now. Um... And are considered the same genus as the house cat. Yes, that's true, rather than big cat buddies. They're still considered a big cat, though, because they are literally a big cat. Um, not pet a cheetah for their safety, more so, yes, because even you, you, literal dead body, not much fat muscle to be had. You could beat a cheetah in a fight. That's true. Yeah, cheetahs are not strong. They're fast, but, like, not strong. They do not have the strength to win. You are very likely to hurt them without meaning to. So it's better to just kind of leave them alone. Um, instead of, you know, risking hurting them. Uh. 
Yes. Oh shit, that's a lot. Alright, I don't... I'll come back for this. Let me go to the blacksmith, dude. Refill all of my arrows. God, I need so much money. <laughs> Alright, to the custom marker. Hope it takes me to the right custom marker. Looks like it is, which is a good sign. But yes, please be gentle with cheetahs. And they're endangered, so that's also another layer to add to this whole situation. They are endangered. Um, thankfully their populations do seem to look like they're on the rise last I checked. That might have changed because I haven't checked in like four years. But it does seem like their populations are on the rise. Yes, cheetahs are endangered, if I remember correctly. They are in fact an endangered species. And if things keep up... Yeah, I know. If things keep going as they were, they would have been the first big cat species to have gone extinct in the modern day. Like, the last one to have gone extinct was believed to be the cat species that essentially got domesticated into the normal house cat. Like, that's no longer around. But to be fair, neither is the dog that got domesticated into the, the, the dog. Um, and it's most likely it evolved out of existence. Instead of it just going extinct, it just generally kind of changed over time. Nice. Nice. Whoa. Is it now? Doesn't seem like a very, um, well fortified environment. Um, the dog that got dogged, yeah. How can nobody be talking? People do talk about it. It's just you're not in the discussion. You, you got left behind in the discussion. That's kind of how it goes is on the internet. I'm afraid, because that's our primary way of communicating. If you're not in the discussion, you won't know.
Is that it? I don't know how I thought that was going to work, but like, we'll, we'll vibe with it. And loot. Hell yeah, location completed. House of Sand Hideout. And we can now. Is this area completely done now? It looks like it. Yeah, it looks like there's nothing else really to explore. Oh, that's 37 to 40, so I'm not even going to try in there. But it looks like we got that whole area figured out. That's Giza, which I'm not going to explore yet. Oh. Okay. Uh, I do want to try to loot this armory here now. Because I've gotten very close, but not quite. Um... Or, excuse me. I told you all, I, I will keep burping and I'm so sorry. Alright. So what I'm probably gonna do, I might end stream early today. Because I'm still really sore. And... Um... I want some time to uh, rest, but I will probably play up until I finish exploring all the areas that I'm kind of like setting out to explore right now. Um, so yeah, that's probably what's going to end up happening. I'm going to go to this blacksmith real quick, buy some arrows, and then head over to try and raid that that treasure area. Let's raid the tomb of Alexander. Alexander the Great, your tomb is no match for me. Not this time. Maybe if your tomb was better hidden, I wouldn't be raiding it. Just a thought. You know, consideration. Where the fuck is this blacksmith? There he is. Come to trade, then. Oh, I have full arrows. Cool. Be well, Over there. Uh. He did. He did kind of die suddenly, but not so suddenly that he couldn't have written a will. Um, and he did write a will. It's just Ptolemy ripped apart that will and said, fuck your will, I'm gonna do what I wanna do. So, you know, it was sudden, but it wasn't so sudden. And then they embalmed his body in honey, which was weird. So, you know, there's that too. And then there's questions of if he was even actually dead. Because it's it's likely that he just 
just went into a coma and they just assumed he was dead. Um, so there's that. There's a lot to be said about, about Alexander the Great and his body. I love all these guys. Funny. Okay, cool. Perfect for me to murder. Um, bro, mad disrespectful. There would be more if we could find it. Yeah, no, I we still don't know what happened there. I just pushed a guy over. That's fucking hilarious. I'm sorry, I just find that so damn funny. Okay. Inky! So now I can climb up here. Boop. Now it's time to snipe from the rooftop. I should not be seen in this area. Yeah, we know that by ya. You guys can't see shit. Now they'll all be poisoned. Alright, let him burn. Burn, baby, burn. Yeah, you're you're gonna miss for a while, bud.
Gotta make sure there are no more people. I don't think there are, though. I think he's the last guy. I'm pretty sure that's not how the devs expected you to play this. But I ain't gonna come. Captain's log! The sturdiness of our triremes made us proud and kept the pirate ships at bay. Many of them were sunk. The cyperot, cypress, tim cypress timber we used to build our ships is the strongest, but we are not provided as regularly with it since Cicero's son became ruler. At least we still have large reserves to build more ships if needed. Hmm. I see. I'm reading everything in here. There's still more stuff, holy shit. <laughs> How am I in the armory and not finding like any arrows at all to pick up? I mean, I have mine, but like I'm in the army, and there are very little arrows. What kind of fucked up sense? What's that yet? Yeah, no, that's... that's it. I do feel bad for the random guy I shot, though. That, that kind of sucked. That sucked for him. But, like, you know, it be that way sometimes. You just... You don't really, uh, get the option. It just kind of happens, you know? Um... All right, let's see what chat is saying. Um, was it commit mostly ranged? Yes, a lot of the fights that happened, and I mean they, the people of commit were well versed in both ranged and uh, uh, non ranged weaponry. Uh, but they preferred stuff that kept opponents far away. They didn't prefer close combat stuff. Um, some might say that that's, like, some groups called that, like, cowardly, but really it was just a logical decision. Um, the bow, uh, pole arms and spears, all of those were, were in use during various times. But the bow was the most common weapon, and it is depicted often, the most often, in art and whatnot. What if I don't want to stop? I don't want to stop. How's that? They're all defending. Um, arrows are on the high ground towers and such. Yeah, I know. But sometimes you can find them just randomly about. Um, so I was hoping I would be able to scavenge some. And sometimes enemies will drop them at this difficulty. <laughs> nah. But nah. Not given that. What? Who's trying to square up with me? Why? Why? Did you not know? It's quiet today. Why are people trying to fight me? For what? Get out of here. Whoa. 
Um, let's see. I could go up to the royal palace, but do I feel like it right this second? Probably not. Um, they want your sick horse, probably. <laughs> I do have a really cool horse. Um, I do, I do love my haunts. Um. <laughs> okay, let's try that again. And this time maybe they won't attack me for standing a respectable distance outside. What the fuck, Richard? You guys are level eight. Get out of here. And you're you're challenging me. Why? Come here. I don't like that you're running. Oh. Yeah, they do know what they want at least, but like, it's not a smart want. Oh, I missed. That's okay. I think I can, though. <laughs> cool. They didn't want to fight. Good. I don't know why they just randomly attacked me. That was really weird. Um, these are those dual swords added to the armory. Yeah, facts. Are you guys gonna square up with me? Or are you good? You good? Cute. All right, now let's see what's going on here. Y'all are 11 and 12. Is there any other people? You're there. How about over here? That is a 12. I don't think there's anything. Oh shit. Nice. See, a rare instance of when the bow, the arrows are not in like a higher level. Um, sometimes they're just there. <laughs> they're just kind of around. It's nice uh, when they're like that because it means I don't have to worry about it. Because while I love high range places, sometimes you just can't get to a high range. Um, oh, wait, there's another one. I think it's just here. I love this music, I will say. Are you... Oh, it says defending, but like, you are doing the pissing animation. Which, I mean, good for you. Relieve your bowels, but like... Hopefully Mirage is as good as this game or better when it releases. I hope so too. I'm really excited for Mirage. I haven't played all of the Assassin's Creed games, so I'm planning on going back to play them in honor of Mirage's release, but I am very excited for Mirage because it looks really good. But then again, looks can be very deceiving, so fingers crossed, but I am looking forward to it. Uh, I am keeping myself mostly spoiler free though. I have only seen like the, the the trailer and that's about it. But I am so excited. I do want to play it really bad. It does look really cool. <laughs> it's going to be a neat story. Do 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 do. 
There's still some more dudes. Gosh, why are, th why are there so many? I mean, I know why. It's the palace, but like, goddamn. I don't see any like braziers though, which I feel like there shouldn't be if this is gonna be a thing, you know? Sleeping. Who's sleeping? Guards? Or just people? Gosh, it's so fucking huge. Holy shit. Why are you so big? I know why, but like, I don't understand why. It feels like such a waste. Oh my- Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> there are so many! I'm not gonna be able to get all of them, but I, I can try. Holy fuck. Um, uh, it's not as many as I thought there would be, but there's still a lot. Um, and that's intimidating. Can I... Oh, there's some... Oh, I didn't even check the walls! Damn! Okay. Oh, no. Uh, I've got my work cut out for me. Okay. Goal number one. No. Eh. Get get to this one. That's my first goal. I am all the way over there. So that's gonna take a lot. Is there isn't there one that's closer though? Am I going crazy? I feel like there is one that's closer. No, it's... Just that one, I think. Um... Hopefully they're going back to actually being a set. Uh... Actually being assassins. Go back to something that looks like a mix of unity and origin and parkour here's hoping also thank you so much for the follow fast hunter i appreciate it so much but here's hoping because honestly um i i i like the parkour element except when you accidentally jump off uh a you know a uh a building and die um don't like that very much but i think that's more of like a limitation of controls uh, than actually being like a bad mechanic. Um, it's quiet today. Is it? No, he donors is at the palace. Is he? Uh, of course. The palace is much more pleasant without you, Doros, and his constant bitching. Oh. <laughs> This guy did not flinch at his comrade just fucking dying. Respect the hustle. You didn't see shit. Want to try again? Uh, from my point of view, Unity had a good parkour system. It just needed a fine tuning. But nope, they just gave up on it. Oof. Yeah, I didn't notice that actually. Um. Kind of hoping they, they, they just work on improving. Because it's not like parkour is impossible to do. 
There's a lot of games that use parkour elements and make it work. Uh, and I've noticed that also a lot of indie games have been doing it a lot recently, which is super cool because it's not like parkour is easy by any stretch of the imagination. So it's kind of cool to see other game devs try it, but also um, makes you wonder what the, the, the bigger guys are doing. Because it's like, come on. You can do it. I believe in you. Are you gonna, you gonna just die yet? Like, you, you good or... Okay, so those guys are poisoned now. I love when they just kind of poison themselves. Uh, this game is so old, but has such a nice small details at the same time. Yeah, this is an older game. I I am surprised by how old it is, because I hadn't started playing it until like three years ago? Two, three years ago? And I'm really enjoying myself. Um, yeah, I'm really behind on the Assassin's Creed trend, by the way. If you hadn't noticed, I've only played like a handful of games. Um... And this is the only one I've ever fully finished. I do plan on playing the other ones, though, which I am so excited for. Because uh, I hear the other ones are really, really good. Um, so I'm, I'm really looking forward to it. I do plan on trying them all out. Even if the fandom is telling me don't try some of them, I'm going to try it. Uh, and see if I like it. But fingers crossed that I do because I genuinely like this why hello soulstone hi hello hello my fair there my fantastic pharaoh hope you've been having a great stream and day today I got home so you were alive I wanted to be here to chill and cheer you on oh thank you soulstone I appreciate it so much um I I'm I'm chilling I'm doing all right I hope you're doing well I hope you're vibing having a good day um and that uh that whatever you were doing excuse me um whatever you were doing today wasn't too draining uh make sure you take care of yourself and and de stim and do all that good stuff uh i mean if i was ubisoft i wouldn't have ended desmond's story just added more assassins to follow that's a fair take i can't wait to see uh more more about that because i am lost on that but I am excited to play through that story and see if I agree with you by the end of it. <laughs> I'm sure that you probably have a fair point, though. Because <laughs> that's not a sentiment I haven't, like, uh, haven't not seen. Like, I've seen that sentiment by other people. There are other people that I know who like these games who have agreed with that feeling. So... <laughs> and I'm just sitting here like, I don't know who you're talking about, but all right, bet... <laughs> Um, work was tiring, but I'm all good. No worries. Oh, good. I'm so glad. I'm so glad you're vibing, that you're feeling okay. I'm hoping this guy dies of poison. <laughs> yes! I, one of the things that I love most about this game is how much of a chaotic bitch I feel. Like, while I'm playing. Like, I just feel like I'm causing the world to burn. I feel like the Elmo GIF. G-I-F? GIF? GIF. I say GIF just to piss people off, but the Elmo GIF, uh, just the, the fire burning in the background. That's how I feel when I play this game. Oh, if you all are going to keep walking into this, this horde of dead bodies, I swear, I like can't do anything to kill you because you guys are just off in yourselves. I'm gonna flower. Oh, you're just gonna carry one of the poison but Did he just oh, <laughs> every time? I love this game. <laughs> I love how stupid the the enemies are. It's so funny. Uh, I mean, I've played every Assassin's Creed since the first one until Origins, so I'd say I'm well-versed on the lore and story. Hey, yo! 
we appreciate that honestly that's awesome special interest moment i can vibe with that feel free to gush just know that i have no idea what you're talking about as of right now because i've i've played origins and a little bit of a couple other games that i don't remember because it was like a year and a half ago that i messed with them so i don't remember which ones exactly um off the top of my head um but i did mess with a handful of them and while i i didn't hate any of them i i origins is my favorite but to be fair it is my first so and also i'm kind of biased uh i don't think i need to say why i'm biased pretty sure y'all get the picture of why i'm biased just um you know oh my goodness they all are based on human patterns, just not smart humans. <laughs> oh my gosh, thank you all for your Ollie, for the bits, for cheering. I appreciate it so much. Thank you. Welcome. Welcome to the stream. I hope you're enjoying yourself and I hope you're doing okay. My back started hurting. <laughs> oh boy. <sighs> I'm I feel like I have to crack it. That's okay. I'm gonna try and assassinate the big dude here. Can I get him? Join the dead. Oh shit. Oof. Oh shit. I've been attacked. Looks clear. Does it really? <laughs> Looks clear. Not there's nothing clear about this. I don't know how they lost me, but okay. Um I'd say go from Assassin's Creed 2 Brotherhood, Assassin's Creed 2, Brotherhood and Revelations, and Assassin's Creed 3. Three, three, three okay, I'll, I'll definitely do that. I am planning on playing all of them, but I will go in the order that you suggest because I am going to assume you know more than me. <laughs> Actually, I know you know more than me. There's no way you don't. Uh, please, Poison. Thank you. You are? Oh, I'm so glad you're doing well. I am so glad. That that warms my heart. I like knowing that people are doing okay. Yeah! I love sniping people. <laughs> That's my playstyle. My playstyle is long range. I like hitting people with the bow. Although I'm running out of ammo. Uh, that's okay. There's a... A little arrow thing over here. Back this way. Also just raid this body. The guy coming though, so I gotta be quick. 
quick. Ooh, yes. More arrows. Oh! How? <laughs> That's what I thought! Um, chronological order makes the most sense story-wise. Yeah, I kind of figured that. I figured that out. Um, that's what a lot of my friends told me, but they were like, ah, you should play this game because of your love for, you know, the aesthetic. And I was like, y y yeah, you know, yeah, it's true. And I mean, they did get me hook, line, and sinker. So, you know, I I'm, I'm definitely interested. Uh, and whatnot. Okay. So I came through this way and there was where I saw the arrows somewhere and I don't remember. Oh, it's there. Okay. It's back in the first area. That's okay. I will. And now the problem remains that I don't know which direction the first area is. Okay. <laughs> Back that way. <laughs> is it obvious that I, I struggle with directions? <laughs> um, I wanted to let you know there was noise off of mic and I heard it in person, but not over stream. Yeah, I noticed that. Um, I, I, I heard the noise. Uh, thankfully it didn't catch, which I am very glad for. I'm very happy it did not catch. Because that was a very loud noise and it makes me mad. That's just, I didn't like that noise because that specific breed of noise makes me very angry. For obvious reasons, because it's usually just people being obnoxious. And they know they're being obnoxious, they just don't give a shit, so... Obnoxious people are annoying. <laughs> oh, shit, 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 Are you poisoned? How did you get poisoned? When did you get poisoned? Oh shit, that guy's poisoned. Okay, we'll just let him die then. Um, I'd say every Assassin's Creed till the third one is a good story-wise. Graphics aren't the best because of how long ago they were made. Just has up. Oh, I don't care about graphics. I play poorly graphics games all the time. I play outdated games literally all the time. Uh, recently, I played through all of the classic Mega Man games, which was like NES era <laughs> on stream. Um, I'm playing through some Game Boy games on stream. I'm playing, playing through a PS3 game on stream right now. Um, there's a couple PS2 and PS1 games that I'm planning on streaming. I stream games that I like the story of and I think are fun. Not games that I think look pretty. If they look pretty, it's an added bonus. Oh, shit. Okay, um. Let's try that again. <gasps> no! Third time's the charm, right? Nice. Play original Spyro? Now, why would I play original Spyro when I have the remake? And additionally, why would I play original Spyro, which I know gives me even worse motion sickness than um, the underwater levels in Spyro 2? Why would I do that? Why would I do that to myself? <laughs> why would you want me to do that to myself?
All right. Yeah, come over. Come on in. Hell yeah. I love the poisoned arrows. They make me so happy. <laughs> they love them so much. And I lean a little too heavy on them. <laughs> yeah! That's why I love the poison arrows. <laughs> Oh, my ammo's full? Hell yeah. Okay, so my question now is how do I get in there? Because that's the next predicament. I guess the next logical decision would be. Can I? Ah! Yeah, his bow. <laughs> What's wrong? <laughs> oh, oh no! No, he landed. Oof. His head is like detached from his body. Oh no. That is pretty funny though. All right, let me scout out this area and see if I can find an entrance. <gasps> Aha. There's one there. I be oh, is that an entrance? No, so it looks like I actually have to just come up that way. Um <laughs> Wait, hold on. What's being said in the chat? You really do sit there like popcorn. Yeah. <laughs> I do. I really do. From my point of view, I think you'll love the games until the third one, story wise, after it gets confusing somewhat. That's okay. I played worse stories. I don't mind being confused by plot. I usually am. I swear it. <laughs> and again, if I could tolerate playing all the Mega Man games, I'm sure I could tolerate playing a little bit of convoluted story. Or even a lot of bit of convoluted story, because I'm gonna be honest, when a game retcons like over half of its story, like, it's gonna be a little fucked up. And that's what that one did, so... You know, <laughs> it just be that way sometimes. It's unfortunate though because i hate when games i don't think that if you have to recon part of your story it's a bit of a problem damn okay that was too far apparently Someone in this room that I'm in has hiccups. 
Probably won't come back, but... Um... The worst story I've ever played in a game... I'll have to think about that. That's totally fine. No need to apologize or to explain yourself. Just if you need to poof, that's totally okay. I don't like the. I don't know. Keep a lookout. Mm. I trust your instincts. Can't see anything. Who shot that? Don't worry about it. Nobody shot it. Actually, Only Cans is a pretty good story. I don't mind Only Cans story. I mean, it's cursed, but I don't mind it. <laughs> yeah, right? It's it, it it just it's it's a fine story. <laughs> Just a little, little weird, you know? Excuse me, pardon me. It seems that this being the... The most, like... Uncomfortable stream, because I can't stop burping, is still holding true. Uh, my stomach's just really upset for anyone who, who missed earlier when I was talking about it. My stomach's really, really upset with me, so that's kind of where I'm at. What the fuck is this bush doing? Bushes don't bend like that! I love it. God, I know that this game was optimized for PS4 and PS3, but damn. It's so funny. Shit. I totally fucked that up. There! Ooh, nice. Why, hello, Ham! I'm doing... Uh, well, I'm kind of doing all right. I... Uh, I am living. Um, I'm having a bit of a flare-up, but otherwise I'm okay. Uh, how are you? I hope you're doing well. I haven't heard from you in a minute. Welcome to the stream. I hope you're vibing. That you're feeling okay. This entire building makes me sad. I don't like it. I like the music though. Yay, people are dying. I don't- okay, I- Somebody's gonna clip that and take it out of context of me going, Yay, people are dying. <laughs> I'm okay with that, though. Because it's funny. Come on, then. Show yourself. Okay, so where's the last... Um... I saw it a second ago. The last treasure, where would that be? I saw it a moment ago. Where would this... Oh, that's totally valid. My laptop needs to be fixed, but I'm okay. I'm streaming on PC. Well, that's totally fair. I'm glad that you have a backup. Um, and I hope that you are able to uh, get it fixed soon. Uh, that's so unfortunate. But still, I'm glad you have a backup. And that you're able to continue streaming, all things considered.
Because I know it can be hard when your computer is like fucked. Hang on. No, I'm not here. Ah, hey. oh, shit. I don't think anyone saw me there, which is a fucking miracle. Holy. Good, goodness gracious. <laughs> me too. That's how I would respond. Sees a dead body. Ah, shit. <laughs> uh, that there's no way. Uh, no other way to respond to that. That's so funny. Just, ah, oh, shit. I don't see anybody. We're sleep again. Okay, so how do I get into... that how? Do I have to go through there? Shit. <sighs> um, I like somehow Jed would respond that way not like all seriousness i love the guided arrow i love the guided arrow too but no i agree jed would respond that way manager jed would 100 percent respond that way just be like ah shit not this again <laughs> like just completely lack of like any actual care just like ah shit here we go again <laughs> no jed is pretty cold <laughs> We can be we can be honest about that one. Jet is Jet is a bitch. We could be honest on that. Love Jed, but we could we could be honest that Jed isn't uh the greatest. Jed is not the pinnacle of empathy. We can we can be totally honest about that. Uh the fool that follows them around. That's what that makes on. The fool that decides to love them? I don't know. All right, time to haul ass. I can teleport. What am I doing? I don't need to stay here. I can teleport. Um, <laughs> makes me think of uh, that Tumblr meme. That's like, bitch, you teleport. <laughs> it's, it's my first thought when I say I can teleport. Bitch, you teleport? <laughs> if you don't know what that is, please look it up. It's really funny. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the most chaotic ARG I've ever seen because the backstory behind it is that the people who started it were just like two students who just had nothing better to do. They were on summer break. They had nothing to do. And they said, you know what? Fuck it. We ball it <laughs> and just started an ARG on Tumblr. 
And they didn't mean for it to be an ARG. They just were like, hey, you know what would be funny if we emulated a bunch of, por a, well, a bunch of, you know, P bots. And so they emulated those bots and were messaging people just the phrase, bitch, you teleport. Um, and it just, it just spiraled into this whole ARG of just like a bunch of different websites and story. It was so chaotic. There was no rhyme or reason. If you haven't, if you haven't seen it, please look up bitch, you teleport. Cause it is so wacky. Uh, that and like <laughs> Sonic Against Social Dust Justice, which is a parody blog of like, uh, anti-social justice warriors stuff and it's so and it's sonic rp it's so weird but so funny i lost my shit reading that <laughs> oh god this <laughs> stuff that happens on tumblr i swear um it makes me think of that meme with the people manifesting out of crows and shadows and portals and someone jumps in like my manager at Denny said you guys can't be here anymore. <laughs> yeah, no, Denny's don't give a fuck. <laughs> All right, so we're going to call it for today. Um, I know it's about like 40 minutes, 50 minutes early. I'm just not feeling good. Um, just because, well, I, I've been in the middle of a flare up. Uh, for those that don't know, uh, because I know that new people have been coming in and out and I haven't really said it much on stream in like a couple of months. Uh, I am a disabled streamer. It says in my tags. Uh, it also says on my about page. Uh, and because of that, I have a bunch of medical conditions and the past two days they have prevented me from streaming and I'm kind of upset about it. So I decided, fuck it, I'm going to stream today. But in the end, what ended up happening was that now I'm kind of in this position where I'm like really sore, not feeling too good. And so I'm like, all right, I'm not going to push myself any further than like I want to. So I'm going to cut it here about an hour early, but I had a good time. I had a lot of fun. Uh, if you want to see me play more Assassin's Creed, oh, well, Assassin's Creed Origins, uh, then I will be live with that next Friday. Uh, not Friday, next Thursday. I play it every Thursday. So, um, but you can also keep up to date with that if anything changes on my Twitter, uh, which is just Crypt Ramsey's. Uh, it's the same username that I use for everywhere. It's the same one on Twitch. If you just paste my username into anywhere, you can probably find me there. Um, so, yeah. I will be streaming Assassin's Creed Origins again on Thursday of next week and probably every Thursday into the foreseeable future. Uh, tomorrow, I believe it's Hyperlight. I think think we're playing hyperlight next week oh you came back at the worst time fast hunter i am so sorry i'm about to end stream <laughs> i hope i feel better too thank you ham uh i would normally okay so i'm gonna rehash this real quick i wouldn't normally stream um for another hour but i am in the middle of a flare-up yes i am planning on raiding uh i am in the middle of a flare-up uh my health is not the best i am disabled so uh i wasn't gonna stream today uh but i haven't streamed the past two days because i've been having a gerd flare-up and an eds flare-up so i was like fuck it i'm gonna stream today uh but if you want to see me play more assassin's creed i'll be live every single thursday playing that game uh and continuing uh otherwise on friday tomorrow i'm playing hyperlight drifter yeah i'm so sorry <laughs> uh you can see my archives though of it i do have archives on youtube um but i will be playing hyperlight drifter tomorrow we're gonna continue the alt run i'm gonna try and finish up tomorrow if i can if my hands aren't up for it for whatever reasons like i just don't think i can handle it i'll probably switch to like fortnite or something like something easy fortnite um or maybe we'll continue with genshin uh but yeah uh also for anybody who's looking for the hollow knight stream that happened last week i am so sorry twitch deleted my vod uh there was no reason for it it wasn't a copyright strike it wasn't any like policy infringement it just didn't archive the VOD for some reason. So blame Twitch for that. I don't know why they did it, but they did it. So um, it's a little frustrating, but there's nothing we can do about it. Thankfully, nothing really happened. Uh, it was just we got into um, the area with the husk. So we are fighting that on Saturday. Uh, but yeah, with all that being said, thank you guys so much for coming to the stream. I'm going to raid out. Let me see if I can find somebody cool who you guys can hang out with. 
Oh, Miss Strange is live, but so is Anu. I raided into Anu last time I was playing Assassin's Creed, so I'll raid into Miss Strange. Uh, cause she's doing a collab. She is playing... Well, Miss Strange is live, so I'm raiding into her. I know I could raid into Cubby, but I haven't raided into Miss Strange in a, in a minute. Uh, she is playing the KFC dating sim, if you haven't seen that. She's a really good friend of mine, so please go hang out with her. She's really chill. Love her to death. And make sure you give her all the love you can, alright? Take care of yourselves and each other, my shopsies. And I'll see you next time. Send up to